What is up guys and welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for clicking. I'm really, really grateful. And to all those who have been coming back to watch my videos, thank you so much. And if you're new to this channel, do me a favor by clicking the subscribe button down there so we can grow this channel together. So guys, a while back, I brought you a video showing you how I installed racks and, and a top box for my 2019 Honda CB500X. And today, I wanna tell you what has happened right after that installation. So guys, after installing the top box on the 2019 Honda CB500X, I'll put a video in the top up banner. You can click and watch it after you've watched this video. And I was very pleased with my installation and I rode it for about two or three days. Uh, but what I realized was that the front end of the bike wasn't as stable as before. And uh, I was experiencing something called tank slapping. So that was a wobbling of the steering wheel. If I left, let my hands go off the steering wheel for a few seconds. So I realized that it was probably uh, because the weight at the back was now more than the weight of the front could bear. So uh, I went to a motorcycle shop and they confirmed that yes, the top box plus the rack that I installed together were too heavy for this motorcycle. Um, and I was very fortunate that the guy at the shop was very kind to allow me to trade in that box with a Shad SH39. Um, because uh, upon measuring, the Shad SH39 came in at about two kilograms, whilst the one that I installed was about seven kilograms. So there was going to be a savings of five kilograms there. And we worked out the price and I was happy to let it go so I could just grab the Shad. And I must say, ever since I got the Shad, um, the front end is a bit more planted. I don't experience as much that wobbling that I experienced before. There's always going to be some uh, something funny going on in the front end of the bike when the back is too heavy, but it's something you can deal with. So I just wanted to bring this video to caution anyone out there who has a Honda CB500X and wants to install a top box. Maybe if you have side panniers, it might not be so much of a problem because maybe the weight is, uh, the center of gravity is low because there's weight on the sides of the bike. But if it's just a top box, then this is something you definitely want to consider the weight the, of the, the, the back of the bike and that is going to have an effect on the front end of the bike and you're not going to like it i've experienced it and that's why i'm bringing you this video just to caution anyone out there who is thinking of installing a top box so guys that's the end of this video i hope this quick information is useful to someone out there who wants to install a top box for their honda cb500x and if you are new to this channel, do me a favor, click the subscribe button so we can grow this channel together. I've got other videos on my channel so you can make time to take a look at them. Again, thank you so much for watching. Till I catch you in the next video, guys. Ride legal, ride safe always. Peace.